Hey everyone, welcome back to Wireless Solutions, your one-stop shop for all things tech. Now, let's talk about something that is probably driving you crazy, notifications. You know, those little pop-ups that make your phone feel like it is a non-stop party, but you are trying to get work done. Yeah, we've all been there, but don't worry. Today, I've got some ninja level tricks for managing notifications like a boss so you can actually get stuff done without your phone constantly buzzing. Now, the phone I am using today is the Infinix Hot 8, but honestly, these tips will work on most Android devices, so stay tuned. Here's the game plan for today's video. 1. Customizing notification settings 2. Using Do Not Disturb mode 3. Managing app-specific notifications 4. Third-party apps or enhanced control So let us get started. 1. Customizing Notification Settings First up, let's make your phone smarter than your average notification spamming machine. Grab your phone and swipe down from the top. No, it is not magic, just the notification panel. Now, hit the gear icon to open settings. From there, go to Apps and Notifications. This is where the magic happens. Now, here's the cool part. Choose an app you want to customize. For example, WhatsApp or Gmail. You can either keep notifications on for your work stuff, like calendar events or emails, while muting social media apps. This way, you will stay focused on work, but not miss the essentials. It is like a VIP list for your notifications. Only the important ones get in. The rest can wait. 2. Using Do Not Disturb mode Okay, now if you need to hit pause on live for a bit, maybe during a meeting, or a Netflix pinch, you need Do Not Disturb mode. Swipe down again and tap that Do Not Disturb icon like you are swiping away all your problems. But here's the trick. Customize it to let calls through from specific people or even allow repeated calls. Because we all know that one person who really needs you might be calling more than once. And the best part? You can schedule it. No one's bugging you while you are in deep work mode or or when you are catching some Z's. It is like having your own personal quiet zone. Ah, please. Number 3. Managing App-Specific Notifications Next up, App-Specific Notifications. This is where you can get really picky. Like, I want this, but I don't need that. Take messaging apps like Slack or Telegram. You don't need to hear from every channel all the time, right? Open up the app. Go to notifications and mute the less important chats. You only need to hear from the people who matter, your team, not your body, who is sending memes. This way, you are only interrupted by what's truly important. And trust me, your productivity will thank you for it. 4. Third-party apps for enhanced control Alright, if you are really serious about controlling your notifications, you might want to bring in the big guns, third-party apps. Apps like Buzzkill or Notific give you even more power. You can set rules for when and how you get notified. Want notifications only during work hours? Done. Want a summary at the end of the day? Easy. Just head over to the Google Play Store, grab one of these apps, and follow the setup steps to create your ideal notification experience. You will be the notification king or queen in no time. And that's all for today's tips on managing notifications like a total pro. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Wireless Solutions and hit the notification bell because, hey, we don't want you to miss any of our future tips. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one. Bye for now.